Hey guys, what is up, and welcome to the 23rd episode of the Yu-Gi-Oh! Career Mode. That is right. So, we are running into the Premier League match with Manchester United with our uh, main squad. So, uh, yeah, yet again, we are going to be forced to really field an extremely weak lineup. So, this sounds nuts, but I'm going to have to actually try Kennedy at left center back, left back, Davies there, and Shawcross is just going to have to be really tired. Thought I'd never see this again, but, uh, Todd Kane, alright, so basically this is a damage limitation lineup in all honesty. Um, we're just really tired from the previous game, man. Uh, with this team it doesn't have the stamina really to last too long into it, so, yeah, I'm just hoping we can all honesty get a decent result against them. So yeah, uh, let's get into it. Alright, so we are moving into the match versus Manchester United. So obviously, as you can see, we're on the same number of games. And at the moment, uh, this game is flat out a must win. There's just no other option than victory. Because there's only six games left, we have no assurances that Manchester United will drop points for the rest of the season. So... It's just a necessity for us to win. Um, I did actually notice in the starting screen that Manchester United made an absolutely huge addition at striker, so it's going to be pretty dangerous for us to play against. But let's take a look at the team. So firstly, we're going to be taking a look at the Man U team, and they have indeed side Luis Suarez, who's going to be a son of a gun to play against. They're playing a 4-2-3-1. Uh, Sergio Romero, Paul Pogba, Ibra, Mata, Rashford on the bench. We're going back to our 4 3, three false 9. Um, I like playing it usually. Uh, in Porto games, I'm going to put chat to do it so we can cope defensively, but hopefully we won't have to do that here. But, uh, really hope. Oh no! We've conceded! It's Wayne Rooney! Oh, jeez, what the? How? What a goal, Rooney! No! I was hoping so much that we could get a goal and go into halftime on level terms. Thanks a lot, Mishi! He's been so bad at this game, honestly. That was so frustrating, though. I just couldn't get a man to him on time, and what a finish. Great goal. It's into Bashuai. It's Bashuai. It's headed! No ball! It's gotta be a penalty ref! Um. Jesus is going on for Batshuayi. Okay, that will, that'll have to work. Alright. Gonna have to see if we can pull one out. And, uh... And that's Chayore. It's Karak. Okay, wins it. It's Jesus! It's Jesus! We've managed to tie it! It's a brilliant whipped in cross by Bertrand Traore, who puts it away. And, ah, oh, thank goodness, man. We needed that. Like, we just desperately needed that goal. And it's finally came when it matters most. Huge goal. Let's make the most of this and actually come back and grab a victory. Well, that's a disappointing 1-1 draw against Manchester United. In all honesty, we were absolutely poor. Like, we were just pitiful in this game. I don't understand, man. Oh, I wish freaking Triori and Musonda were fit because Shrievers let us down 10 million times. I just can't be asked with this game sometimes. I really can't be asked sometimes. Thank goodness we have a lot more of our classy players left. Um, Alonzo's going to be one change for Davies. Um, Shrievers is not even going to make the bench. I'm going to swap him off for Gonzalez. He was really a huge letdown in this game. Um, yeah, I'd rather have Shalaba than Noble, honestly. He has more salmon as a substitute player. But yeah, this is the fun three we're running with. Uh, Disappointing draw against Man U, so hopefully we can uh, go and ensure that we are able to win this match against Porto. At bare, bare, bare minimum, we need to uh, 
get a draw, but uh, hopefully whatever we get is going to be enough. Alright, so second leg of the Europa League draw against FC Porto. So we're in the quarterfinals currently. So they're showing lineups already. So uh, a couple changes. Masanda's back, thank goodness. Our wing play has been horrific in the last game against Man U. But uh, center backs are indeed rested up. Uh, the Man U game was kind of a bit more sacrificial as uh, getting a draw in hindsight is a pretty good result. Then Porto, so they have Alex Telles, who is indeed playing. Uh, they got Jota, Suarez, they're playing a 4, a th wait a second. That was like a 3-3-3-2. Three, 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 Thanks a lot, you useless twerps! Oh, unbelievable. Oh, great job in the defense. You oh, Tebow couldn't do anything about that. Just no! Tebow didn't die for this. You're losing the ball again. You're actually losing the ball. Stop. Use your brains! Uh, I am actually triggered right now. I am so triggered. Kim okay, is we gotta make something happen before halftime or else I think we're really screwed. Oh. <laughs> Lol. Fabregas. It's Ducure. It's Ducure! Oh, it's in! Oh, we do have some hope after all. We're gonna have to score three, I think two more goals at least but we can bring this back honestly we can bring this back it's a good solid goal right before halftime and uh yeah good ball good run by Decore. nobody was marking him the shot taken on and yeah just grateful uh Casillas slipped up a little bit but this was luck we deserved because that second goal um as you know i may have Blank out of the commentary for reasons you may be able to guess. Uh, we're gonna need a bit of a miracle at the moment, but, um, yeah, this was not the way I was envisioning, uh, this game going at all. Like, <laughs> it's kind of a disaster. It's Ducure, it's Ducure. It's Alonzo. Masanda, Masanda, what a finish! And it's, it's tied on aggregate! Charlie Masanda puts it away! And we are only one goal from managing to pull off a comeback yet again. Great play, Triore to Jesus, Jesus to Masanda, and Masanda with a stunning finish right into the top right corner. Masanda the lad puts it away, and within a few minutes we have been able to bring back the goals. Absolute relief. Triore. It's Triore! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness, it's a goal! How is Casillas laying that in? Oh, it's incredible look! And within a few minutes, Casillas has let himself down. It's unbelievable! We've done it! We've managed to pull three goals back within 17 minutes. Oh my goodness gracious me. Oh my! Oh. It's Alonzo, it's Alonzo. It's Al Shot cross. It's okay, okay, okay. It's Masanda. Mishi, Mishi! Oh, Mishi! Mishi! Mishi, the hero! It's 4 3! And we've got another goal for Porto! It's Mishi Meshiwai! With a brilliant finish! Oh, I'm speechless! Oh, Mishi! Mishi! Oh, Mishi! Balls passed through to Mishi. Mishi takes one touch and what a finish into the corner! God, we need to learn how to play defense! 
Oh, what a finish by Mishi coming up clutch when it matters most. Mishi, my man. Oh, what a ball. Nathan Ake coming up from central midfield. And we have clinched it. It's a 5-3 epic victory over Porto. What a pass there from Mishi. Ake all alone. Was not expecting to see him, but Nathan Ake puts it away like an experienced striker. It's a great finish there. And crushes the hope of Porto. This has been an epic of a match. And oh my word, I think we've actually done it. Here we go, we've done it! It's a huge 5-3 victory over FC Porto. And we are into the Europa League semi-finals. What an epic of a match that was. Oh goodness gracious me. What a performance. What a performance from us. We scored five goals from the 45th minute on. I thought we were done when Suarez scored off the uh, double rebound. But we, we bloody done did it. It's going to be the end of the episode, so I want to thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and I will see you guys later. Peace!